guys out here on the Savannah River. Let me start off with a frog. Daddy Van Dam's using a chatter donk. We're gonna see what we can get into. We're on the beach here earlier. It just it wasn't it. I think we could have caught him good, but we'd have to wait like three to four hours for that water to get right. I just wasn't wanting to wait that long. It's like you're just killing time, kind of hitting random stuff, and we're not really fishing productive. I'd rather come out here on the Savannah River, which I haven't been to in a while. Like the Ogeechee, it's been about five to six months. I've only gone one time and then out here it's been, it's been shoot longer than that. It's probably, probably been seven months. So we're gonna see what we can get going today. See if we can get a few fish. The weather's actually really nice. The sun's finally peeking through the clouds. I just tied on a frog just to kind of play around and get a frog fish, it'll be fun. We're mainly going to be fishing a lot of this cover, especially this tide being an outgoing tide. We're about halfway through it. And some of these fish just are moving out to this main, riv main river. What was that? Turtles? <laughs> turtle, turtle. Dude, I can tell you the last time I fished pads on the Savannah. That would be cool to catch a frog too. Oh, this is really good, dude. I'm gonna throw a spinner bait, guys. Give it a little shot. Bump it off some of these lay downs. You guys are wondering about the water temp 72. Down in Florida last week, it was between 80 and 85. Really? Oh, it's probably a moss keeps getting on it. Golly, that bite was insane. Don't come off, that's a good one too. That distracted me, dude. Whatever to the left, it hit it at the same time. That's a freaking good one, dude. That's a good bass on the frog, guys. Look how fat. That's a fat dude. Look at that. Wow, I didn't mean to splash you, you all right? Yeah. Bro, look at that fish. That's awesome. a stubby guy, ain't it? Look at that, guys. <laughs> on a frog, I, I tied it on. Just to kind of play around today, and <laughs> I don't know, first fish of the day on the Savannah River. We've been out here for what, 10 minutes? And freaking good one on a frog, that's, that's exciting. We're gonna put him in the box. That's a little fat guy. Maybe get a cool picture at the end. That is literally a two and a half pound fish in a one pounder's body. That's insane. Whatever, I did the same thing you did. You heard that blow up on the left and I looked at you, but as I was looking, dude, he just... Gosh. I was afraid I was gonna lose him. That looks money. I'm not throwing up there that deep. I mean, you think they're that deep up there? Yeah. I mean, I'm not saying you gotta be that deep, but this fish is hug up on that, especially the, the cypher shoes. Look at that. Come on, that looks so good. I didn't even cut the legs on this thing, dude. I was gonna cut them. Neither would you. get one of these pads guys i would be so happy to get on a frog bite i honestly like the pads don't even look good to me like in my opinion if i've gone that where that wood meets the bank is better in my opinion we'll go hit this left side a little bit and then we'll go uh we'll go in the back and hit just a few spots and go to a good spot Look how that skirt flares out. Okay. Guys, I probably shouldn't be throwing this frog, but um, 
I, I think I could catch a fish or two on it. I just think I can definitely have already had some more fish in the boat. But it was a good fish that ate it. And I think I could definitely get another bite. And it's just a lot of fun. Love frog fishing. broke no is the there's like a steel cable and it just came off just completely oh i got one Right where he should have been. His belt pull out of my rod out of my hand. I had to lean up on him. He was stuck in that in those trees. Look how fat they are, dude. Oh my goodness. I'll tell you, they're eating. Little tiny one, second fish of today. Kind of had some trolling motor problems. The trolling motor's broken, but that guy is fat. It's fat, dude. All right, big C, your turn. This is what we're having to do right now to steer. <laughs> Not the best way to get to spots, but we're doing what we got to do. I'm trying to get Big Steve on a fish before we fix his trolling motor. Oh, ha, 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 ha. oh that was a that was a big mud fish. He hammered the heck out of me. He broke me right off, guys. First cast on this new spot. See how clean that is, dude? He went th one hard time. He felt huge. Oh, gosh. You hammered the mess out of it. Throw in there, Dad. That, that was the craziest bite. He should eat it. Oh. 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 Throw in there. Throw in that. Reed, dude, he must have been looking at it because right when I reeled right it. Yeah, yeah, your money. I don't think I stuck him either, dude. He didn't. Yeah, look. Look at his teeth marks behind my bait. That was a good bite, dude. Come on, get this fish. I, I was working it on the bottom, all of a sudden I reeled it, dude, and he just went, Dum. So I was just kind of dragging him. Oh, oh yeah, it, yeah, yeah, he did. Oh. oh, bro, what is going on here? Guys, I don't know what happened in the last 15 minutes, but we've had probably six, seven bites. So we're in the right spot. We just gotta capitalize here. They're not eating it right though. They're slamming it and then they just don't hold on to it for some reason. Oh! Big one? Oh my gosh, it's a mudfish. That scared me, dude. I thought you had like a six, seven pounder. Oh my gosh. When the mouth came up, I was not expecting that. I haven't fished out in so long. Hey, you got your first fish. Well, Big Steve, <laughs> you got your first fish. He's a big one, too. Look how fat he is. Gosh, that's a thick boy. And these guys I do not bring in the boat. No mud fish in the boat. I thought you had a big bass for a second there. That thing's nasty. I'll fix your bait for you. I'm touching it. Bench your hook a little bit. Well, at least I snatched it, man. But hey, listen, we've had a tough little day. Just the trolling motor and everything, but we're still getting some fish. We're still getting some bites. We had a lot of bites down that other bank, and I don't know what happened. We're going to move here in a second. There are a couple more. 
probably go off on this other side where it bends. Yeah, this is the stuff that I'm doing right now. I try to get my bait unhung and it unhung and stuff. You got one? Oh, he's running at you. Catch up with him. Oh, he's a war mouth. That's a huge <laughs> war mouth. I was like, I what are you got? I'm about a bass today. Hey, you're doing <laughs> you're doing the Savannah River Slam. You're gonna catch every fish, and then you're gonna catch a bass. Look how pretty that fish is. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Look at that. See how chunky he is. Yeah. I bet that'd be good good eating. You see like the red on his his fins too. He's pretty. Every fish that we've caught today, like the bass, the mudfish. Look at the belly on that thing. Like that's just that's insane. Whatever a warm out. There. Look at that one in the distance, dude. Look how I'm coming. I'm calling him in. You see that? Look, how I'm swimming. Dude. You like that? Look at look how fast he's coming. Pull <laughs> something pop right here. Yeah. Look at him, he's coming, Mom. You see that? Look. Dude, what in the world? I got a freaking nice one. I don't know, he's running. No, it ain't. What is that? It's a bat. Oh, it's a freaking big one, dude. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Dude, I'm talking giant. Oh! <laughs> dude, that's five pounds. I can't even believe that just happened. Dude! can't even believe that just happened. <laughs> just playing around. Dude, the frog is what's on. Wow. I'm a, that's a big one, dude. Mm. I was looking at the gator and you're like, whoa. And I like looked up and my frog was gone. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Well, I saw some chase bait. So I was like, I'm gonna throw that. That's a freaking giant, guys. Freaking giant. That's Savannah River Toad. When he came up next to the boat, it looked like a mudfish, but the colors of them were green. The color, yeah, the color was just weird, like washed out. Maybe I need to throw that frog more. That's crazy. I Dude, literally threw it out of there. Out I was nowhere. I wasn't even watching. I was looking at the gator. The gator was starting to come over because he saw my frog, and I was just popping it. And then you said something. I look up, and there's a huge splash. That was crazy. I don't know. Holy cow, guys. That was crazy, guys. Maybe we need to... Throw the frog a little bit more. I, it's something that I don't throw on the Savannah River often. And <laughs> I've caught two fish on it today. One being like a solid two and a half pounder and the other one being like a five. <laughs> like that's some big Savannah River fish and they're eating the top water. I mean, shoot. I mean, they won't eat anything else either. No, they won't. I mean, we're throwing the, we threw a bunch of Texas rigs and we got a ton of bites, but nothing that would like really hold on to it much you know i only caught that one on it and then he had some mud fish and, but i don't know we're not really able to fish how we really want to the, the trolling motor like i didn't really show y'all but the cable snapped so i literally just gotta i gotta manually do it so i told him i was like a little crankbait or a square bill would be money down this bank um but I didn't want to throw it because it's like, I, I'm always reaching down and turning the boat. I want to throw the frog a little bit more. I don't really, I want Big Steve to catch a few. I'm just gonna kind of mess around with this. Oh, we'll get him. Oh, nice dad, get him around that. Oh! <laughs> Finally, pulled him out of the back. slop pulled him out I of the forest you know what i'm throwing up there i don't care <laughs> hey that's the risk you gotta take to get the bites a little fat one wow that took that's all nice. day you think you got your first bass that's of the, the day. four hour fish y'all <laughs> hey but you caught you caught a warm mouth and your first warm mouth and you caught a mud fish it's a pretty fish He's not big, but it, they're just thick out here, man. They're chunky. He's big. He must be at least six pounds. <laughs> I, when I saw your line pop, I was <laughs> like, oh my God. You gotta be six, you know what I'm saying? I don't know why. I just looked at that tree and said, you know what? I gotta throw in there. Wait. 
<laughs> another warmouth. Big Steve somehow figured out how to catch another warmouth. I can't get away from these things. Little brutes. They're cool looking. That one's not as pretty as the other one, but it's not as big either. Mm -mm. Little Twinkie. Little Twinkie. Oh, gosh. Not missing you that time, buddy. It's a mud fish. That's the one that bit me earlier. He's going crazy. God, this guy's huge, dude. You ready? I can't even turn him. <laughs> He's big. Oh no. Oh no. Catfish. No wonder he's fine like that. That's what hit me earlier that hard was a catfish. Look at how he's circling. See how he's circling? I was about to say that's a little weird. Got a war mouth, mudfish, caddies. Oh. That's a freaking big one, dude. That's a big bass, dude. <sighs> I cannot believe that. Alright. Yeah, that's another freaking giant, dude. What in the world? What is he, about four? Three and a half? Three and a half, yeah. Crazy. And big ones are biting, dude. You we got know. almost 12 pounds of three fish. I got a bag. I got a bag. Yeah. Look at those fish, man. That's crazy. Big Steve's catching all the species. Your boy's catching the daddies. All right, it's your turn, Big Steve. Dude, he was running. He ran to the right so hard. He had me wrapped around that stump. Let's freaking go. I got three good ones in there, guys. If we like had a working trolling motor, a full day of fishing, and just like putting our heads down and moving, we'd have a bag today, guys. I'm talking a bag. We could... Listen to that. <laughs> oh, 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 what happened? What happened? I don't know. I looked at him. I heard him. I, he fought for a minute and a half and quit. Get we've had a day guys i i really all we have to do is catch like another like a two pound fish and we one or two two pound fish would easily have 15 pounds that's crazy but i mean i know if we like fish hard like we could have 17 I mean, we might be able to put a 20 pound bag together i mean we got three really good ones in there i was surprised by that one i threw up right here if you guys look um at these laydowns i threw right up there all of a sudden i started like reeling it and kind of popped it over a stump and i felt thump and i saw a swirl and he was running off to the right with it that was a good one. This is all like territory that we fished earlier today. We're just coming back through to kind of cleaning up because last time we didn't we didn't fish clean. So there's big ones. All right, guys, here we go. There's some good fish, man. Good river bass. We're actually about to get rained on. I'm trying to release these real quick so we can haul butt back. Those are our two biggest ones today. About a three and a half and a four, five, four to five pounder. Beautiful fish. Easy four pounder. There she goes. Well guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button on it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. Check out Big Steve's channel right there. Flip, flip it around, show your face, man. I show can't you. do it. You don't wanna show your face? <laughs> Check out Big Steve's Check channel. out the loser, Big Steve, for the day. <laughs> I know, Big Steve is talking all this trash and we happen to come through and uh, catch some good fish, but you caught some good ones and you caught your first warm mouth. We caught a variety today. It was a good day, especially with the trolling motor breaking. But I'm going to stop talking, guys. I will catch you all in the next episode.